I'm lacking my bun today, which I normally don't. I normally don't like my hair up. I'm digging the red earrings. I'm digging this fall outfit. I'm digging it. Hey guys, today I am here to do my second ever Dollar Tree favorites. I did a Dollar Tree favorites for the very first time like about a month ago. I will link it down in the description box below if you wanna go check it out. I just thought that I could just share with you the items that I haul from the Dollar Tree and why they're my favorite and how often I use them because in a Dollar Tree haul, I just kinda of show you the item and then it's like I never follow up on it, so I definitely want to share with you how I feel about the items afterwards. It's kind of like a review, but it's me just sharing you only my top 10 favorites. Last time, I actually don't think I went in any particular order, so this is me just kind of improving my channel. And I am going to go in order, starting at number 10 as the least favorite to number 1. I did ask in my last video if it was a type of video you wanted to see, like, every month, every two months, quarterly, and the majority voted for every month. And I made, to come up with these top 10 was so incredibly easy. Now, I am calling this my Dollar Tree October favorites, and we're still in October, but I've been using these items long enough to know they're my favorites. So I don't think my favorites video will come out at a certain point in time. I wanted to just go ahead and share with you these items as quickly as I could. So let's go ahead and get started. So coming in at number 10 is going to be Dollar Tree candy. And I can't begin to express how impressed I am by their selection. I do obviously wish that there was more quantity in some of the bags, but otherwise I was pretty happy. And there is a mix in here, I think it was called Fun Mix, which has some of my favorite candies. Like these little things right here are just delicious. And I love the orange one so much. And then they just have like so much variety. And of course I have a lot of name brand things that I picked up from the Dollar Tree as well, but they're kind of buried in here. But number 10 is going to be the Dollar Tree Halloween candy. Coming in at number nine is in an organization tool. It is this blue file folder that I hauled from the Dollar Tree. If you wanna go look at all my hauls, you will see all of these favorite items in one of those hauls. But I love to get file folders, any kind of storage item for myself. And when I saw this, I thought this was the coolest thing that I had seen at Dollar Tree because it is fabric lined on the sides, trimmed with this black fabric, and it's this blue, but it's also transparent, which I really, really love. I am going to try to start to organize my craft room, my personal papers, my stickers as best as I can just because after I moved into this house, I feel so out of whack because I don't feel organized whatsoever. I feel like it's a little bit of chaos because this house is a really open floor plan, which means no storage. So I need to start figuring all that out and finding really good places to put things that make sense. And I am loving this spa folder from the Dollar Tree. I have gone back and I have not found it again. So I guess when they put this out, a bunch of people bought them. They have them in different colors as well. Coming in at number eight is this little beauty. If you watch Dollar Tree hauls, you have probably seen this a time or two. I have had this for months now. And when I saw this at my Dollar Tree, I was like, oh my gosh, it's so great. Everyone seems to love this. I'm gonna try this. And at first I really didn't get what the hype was all about, but I can't begin to tell you how much I love this notebook now because this is where I write all of my stuff for my list for the Dollar Tree. Whenever there's something that I want from the Dollar Tree, it goes in this book. I also write all of my video information on when I think I wanna do them, what kind of videos I wanna do. It all goes into this, and I love that it's so tiny that it fits in my purse. And also, I can just take a pen, and it kind of fits just nice and snug on the side like this. So I absolutely love this, have been using this for months and I'm pretty much halfway through this. So I am going to have to buy another one. I did see one the other day when I went and it was like in a tan color. I'm gonna have to get it because the color really doesn't matter that much to me. I just love this notebook in general. I love the fact that it's small enough to fit in my purse and it's not that heavy either. 
Coming in at number seven are some more folders. Now, these I love so much because I got two for a dollar, and I have mentioned that in my hauls before. Any time that you get more items for one dollar is always gonna be a great deal at Dollar Tree with the exception of food and candy. So sometimes you get a better deal at other places. But things like this I think is a really great deal. And I got two patterns in one. And I use these right now for my stickers. I have been using these for a couple of months now, maybe a month and a half, two months, I'm not sure. And I absolutely love them. So even though this, I'm going to be updating my sticker organization but so far for what I have now this has worked out really really well for me and once I move my stickers out of here I will be using these to organize with like my personal papers and I may actually use these for my gift stuff where I can put like birthday cards and extra cards and that way when I need to put a gift together really quickly I can just go to this folder and pick out a card from it and I'm done so love those Coming in at number six is actually a Halloween decor item. It is these black spiders. I have seen these. These are a repeat decor item from the Dollar Tree, which I've also talked about. There are some items that make a comeback and there are some that don't. And these spiders I have seen for quite a few years now and never really got into them until this year when I realized how many amazing things I could really do with them. I did the cutest Halloween candy jar tutorial using the spider. I will link that down below if you to go check it out. I'll insert a picture just so that you can see it. I have loved this spider so much. I also use the spider in my Hollow Dollar Tree Halloween vase tutorial and I will insert a picture of that here as well. It's kind of hard to see the spider in the picture but he's just kind of hanging out on the vase and I have loved this cute little black spider. Coming in at number five is this big pen. Now, if you watch my videos, then you know what I'm talking about. I absolutely love this pen. I love how smooth it writes because I love smooth writing. I have like lazy writing, so smooth pens kind of helps with lazy writing because it's it just kind of goes with you. And I absolutely love these pens. I found these at Walmart, which I mentioned in my last haul, and I'll insert a picture for you if I still have it. But at Walmart, for a package of four is $3.47, whereas a package for two at Dollar Tree is $1. So if I got four pens total, it would be $2 from the Dollar Tree and $3.47 at Walmart. So you're saving $1.47. So I need to go get some more of these because I'm absolutely addicted to this style of pen. And it's both black ink, which I love. I love black ink. So. This is, has been a favorite for the past couple of weeks now. Coming in at number four is something I honestly did not think that I would find to be a favorite. When it comes to cleaning supplies, I'm kind of that person who thinks name brand is gonna be great, even though I know better. If the ingredients are comparable to a name brand, it does the same thing, but there could be a difference maybe in the quality of the wipe, but this is like a dupe for the Clorox. It's good and clean disinfectant wipes. It kills cold and flu viruses, but on non on hard, non-porous surfaces only. And it kills 99% of bacteria in 15 seconds. It kills E. coli and salmonella. And I have been so impressed with the quality of the wipe. It's so thick and smooth. And I absolutely, it, this makes my life so much easier because I can just take this wipe and just go throughout the house and clean all the doorknobs, all the faucets, all of those things that we touch. Because if I don't use these, I, I just have a spray. Like I go to Walmart, I get the disinfectant spray, but that process is so difficult. You have to go around, you spray everything, and then you actually have to turn around and wipe it off. You don't just spray and walk away. You actually, if you read the instructions, at least on mine, you have to spray, wait like 15 minutes or something like that and wipe it off. Whereas this thing says that it kills 99.9% .9 of bacteria in 15 seconds. So I absolutely love this. I will keep hauling this if they keep putting this out. Okay, coming in at number three are gonna be my Halloween washi tapes. Are these not the prettiest thing you've ever seen? And each of them was a dollar, but I will say, look at how much you get in this. And I have been using these on my planner. Now I did a plan my week 
plan my week with me video and I did not do a Halloween theme just because it was homecoming week. So, but this will be in my next week. And again, I made a comment in that video that if you want to see me do a Halloween theme for my plan my week video um, or plan my week planner, then let me know and I will do a video for you. But these have been a favorite of mine. I absolutely love these. I don't think that I purchased every single one. I may have missed one or two, but I absolutely love these so much. Coming in at number two are of course gonna be stickers. If you watch my video, are you surprised that it's not number one? Well, number one is very interesting. I can't wait to talk about it, but let's just go with number two, which are stickers. And these are some of the new ones that I have hauled and I absolutely love these. I mean, look how cute these owls are. And they have like jewels on their noses. I mean, for the Dollar Tree, this is just amazing quality. And I've talked about this before. Stickers like these at Hobby Lobby or Michaels would be well over four to five dollars. So I absolutely love these stickers. As a matter of fact, I was at Walmart the other day and they have a range of stickers that are like 97 cents. So three cents cheaper than the Dollar Tree, but I couldn't even get myself to buy them because they just weren't like the same quality. And I felt like Dollar Tree stickers were just so much better. I literally could not get myself to buy them because I was like, no, I just want Dollar Tree stickers. And then these are some of my favorites. I haven't been able to use these yet. And these are cute cupcakes. And then here's the back so that you can see really clear and they're so pretty. I got two of those because you never know if those are gonna come back. And then this is like a little princess one. And I will be, I will be doing themes in my planner, so that's why I kinda got this. Here is another one that I really love. I can't wait to use it. It's a little circus. And then this one, which is kind of like a storybook theme. I wanna call it storybook, but I'm sure a lot of people will see it and they think baby, baby scrapbooking, but I'm gonna call it storybook because I don't have a baby in my life. I have a 14 year old baby. And then this one is so cute because it's kind of like peace, love on earth, 70s, hippie vibe. And I love this because my daughter is such a hippie and I got this thinking of her. And when I say she's a hippie, I don't mean she dresses like one. I mean she has the attitude of one. She's so laid back. She's like, what? So yeah. Here are some other ones and they're so cute. It's like fair food. I don't know if you can see that without the glare, but I love these and I cannot wait to use these. I love Dollar Tree stickers. Coming in at number one, my Dollar Tree October favorite. It's going to be absolutely silly and I have no idea what your reaction is going to be, but it's basically a sticker album. Mm -hmm. Frozen one and a Disney princess one. I have been watching videos on YouTube for a while where people collect these sticker albums and then they open up the packets of stickers and insert the pick stickers into the album. And for me, it is so incredibly soothing. For somebody like me, my mind does not shut off. It is constantly going. I observe everything around me. I'm not ADD, I'm not ADHD, I just have a brain that just doesn't shut off and I, I people may want to say it's the same thing but it's really not because I'm actually not a hyper person by any means but these sticker books relax me so incredibly much just watching the videos is so relaxing because what it does is it makes me not think about the 500 things that I'm thinking about and I focus on this and it like captures my attention it holds my attention and I absolutely love this. And I never thought in my wildest dreams, and I guess this is in my wildest dreams, which is sad, that I would find this at the Dollar Tree. And I found this only a couple of days ago, and it's in my favorites because I'm completely obsessed with this. When I saw this at the Dollar Tree, I thought I was gonna have to be wheeled out, okay? Because my legs couldn't walk. They sell these for a dollar. They sell each packet for a dollar and I compared it to prices from the actual place where you can buy them online and it's pretty spot on. So it's not like the best deal, but it's not losing money either. So I love these and 
what you do is you just buy the sticker packets and each sticker has a number on the back and then you find that number in the book and you put the sticker on that number. That's it. That's it. It so does wonders for me. I absolutely love it. It's like, it's like a puzzle. It's really like a puzzle, but with stickers. So it's totally genius. As you can see, I already have some stickers in here. This is pretty random. But if you guys want me to do a video where I unwrap stickers and put them in this book and you wanna see me do it, comment below and let me know because I watch a lot of people on YouTube do this and I love it. It's so relaxing. It's absolutely soothing. So if this is something that you think you would find soothing and relaxing, just comment below, let me know, and I will be happy to do the video for you. I also got the Frozen book. There was another book that they had at the Dollar Tree, which was like Mickey or Minnie and Daisy. Haven't bought that one yet, but I'm going to. And I will say I was really surprised when I was opening up the stickers. There weren't that many duplicates. So I was really finding a lot of stickers to put into the book. So this is my number one favorite. When I tried to explain this to my mother, she thought I was absolutely crazy. She, she laughed. I was like, yeah, this is crazy, but I love it. And I have just like, I just love it. Chances are this is a huge sign that I may need to get a life. So that is my top 10 October favorites for this month. Comment below and let me know which one was your favorite. And also, if you want me to do the sticker album book, let me know, comment below on that as well. I hope you guys loved my October favorites. I know I do, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.